I'm going to do a countdown of my top 10 Helga and Arnold relationship moments. Helga and Arnold's complicated relationship was a constant theme throughout the Hey Arnold series. While watching the show as a kid, it was always funny to see Helga pretend to not like Arnold by picking on him, but then, when she was alone, confess her true feelings in such an eloquent yet very sad way. What's that you say? I dance divinely. My eyes are lovely. You've never seen a more beautiful girl. I knew you could fight your true feelings for In this video, I'm going to talk about those cringe-worthy moments where Arnold almost learns about Helga's secret love, those sweet moments where Arnold's kind soul makes Helga's tough heart melt, and a whole lot more. If you are not subscribed to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button to get notified when I post my next video. So without further ado, let's get into it. Number 10. Starting off this countdown at number 10, we have a special moment from season 1 episode 8 titled Arnold's Hat. The episode begins with Helga longing to complete her Arnold's shrine with Arnold's hat. I'll never get it! Never, never, never! No matter what I do, I'll never get Arnold's hat! Miraculously, Helga's wish came true. I knew I'd get it! I knew it all the time! Oh, Arnold, my love! This made Helga over the moon happy while Arnold was devastated. No! I'm not coming out without my hat! Ever! For the rest of my life! Arnold's parents gave him his hat when he was a baby, and it was one of the few belongings he owned that reminded him of his lost parents. Helga knew she had to right this wrong, so she looked high and low and eventually just as easily as she had found his hat in the first place, it found its way back to her. This led Helga to return Arnold's precious hat to him, and when she does, Arnold expresses his sincere gratitude, causing Helga to almost lose her cool. I love this moment because even though Helga really wanted his hat to complete her shrine, she knew it meant a lot to Arnold and realized it was more important that he had it instead of her. Number 9 At number 9, we have a moment that I never thought I would actually see. In season 3 episode 19 titled Girl Trouble, Arnold finally has enough of Helga's taunting and decides to fight back. Come on, Helga, let me paint something. Forget it, Buffalo Boy! I'm doing the painting, not you! Give me the paint! You want the paint? Hey! I think it was clear from Arnold's face that he instantly regretted what he did. His action surprises everyone. Helga, the rest of the class, Mr. Simmons, and Arnold's grandpa. You oh my word, you snapped Arnold! You turned into a vicious, paint pouring thug! All the backlash made Arnold realize that he made a big mistake. He then did what he does best and did the right thing by apologizing. Arnold's sincerity causes Helga to float on cloud 9. I love this moment because it really showed the depth of Arnold's good nature. He was not afraid to be honest with Helga and admit that he was wrong, even though he himself had been wronged by Helga many times without a single apology from her. Number 8 At number 8 is the time where Arnold gave advice to Helga that changed the way she looks at her older sister Olga. This moment is found in Season 3, Episode 5, and is titled, Olga Gets Engaged. In this episode, Olga falls in love with a man named Doug, but he is not the person whom she thinks he is. Wow, Helga! I had no idea Doug used to be a professional race car driver. Wise up, Arnold. The guy's a fake. A fake? He's been lying about all the stuff he's done ever since he got here, and he's planning on living off Olga and my dad. Really? And your sister still wants to marry him? <laughs> she doesn't know anything about it. It's my little secret. At this point, Arnold, who was an only child, tells Helga that she should help her sister get out of the manipulative relationship instead of just letting it happen. Well, if he's really as bad as you say he is, you gotta do something, Helga. No, I don't. It serves her right. Olga's always gotta be so perfect. It's just that if you have a sister and she's in trouble, you're supposed to do something about it. 
Hey, who asked you anyway? Okay, forget I mentioned it, Helga. I love this moment because it was due to Arnold's caring nature and his desire to help Helga and her family that eventually led to Helga empathizing with Olga instead of just seeing her as an enemy. Helga then stood up for her sister against Doug and ended the toxic relationship, which was ultimately in Olga's best interest. At number 7 is the time where Helga loses one of her most prized possessions, her Arnold Locket. In Season 5, Episode 6 titled Helga's Locket, Helga accidentally drops her locket and it is carried into Arnold's house by his pig, Abner, much to Helga's horror. This leads the nine-year-old to break into Arnold's home in a desperate attempt to retrieve the locket. The locket contained a newly inscribed inscription of Helga's name. Using some quick thinking, Helga accomplishes her mission. I love this because it illustrated the lengths Helga would go in order to prevent Arnold from knowing how she truly felt. Because she was so adamant that he never learned about her feelings, it kept her and Arnold's relationship in this confusing and constant state of unrequited love. Number six. At number six, we have another moment where Arnold turns the tables on Helga. In season five, episode 14, titled April Fool's Day, Arnold gets back at Helga for her endless pranks against him by temporarily blinding her. I mean, your birthday was last week, right? Oh my gosh, I can't believe you remembered. Yeah, so? So happy belated birthday. Oh, Arnold, my beloved, you're so I solemnly swear I'll never play another prank on you again. Well, uh, gee, Arnold, thanks. <laughs> Helga then decides to take advantage of his guilt by pretending her blindness is permanent. Once Arnold finds out the truth, he finally gets his revenge. King of Fools is you, Arnold. Actually, it's you, Helga. April Fools. I love this moment because unlike the first time where Arnold gets back at Helga, this time it was in the spirit of April Fool's Day and was not interpreted in such a harsh way. It was also a rare moment where Arnold was able to playfully have fun with Helga by playing along with her prank while secretly pranking her instead. Number 5. At number 5, we have another moment where we see Helga's desperation to keep her love for Arnold a secret. In Season 4, Episode 6, titled Helga's Parrot, Helga's pet hears her confess her love for Arnold and then starts repeating it. Helga tries to make the bird stop, but it refuses and ends up flying out of her window. It then, of course, flew right into Arnold's home. <coughs> Helga then attempts to take it back, but Arnold finds it and grows so attached to the bird that he even takes it to school for show and tell. At this point, Helga is so fed up that it appears she tries to silence the bird once and for all. I just wanted to point out though, I love how right at this moment, Arnold and Lila are just watching Helga in awe, as if they can't tell what she's about to do. <laughs> Luckily, Helga didn't actually have to hurt the bird because it was eaten by another animal instead. I love this moment because it shows again the absurd lengths Helga would go to in order to protect her secret. This time, she was willing to murder her family's pet, who was just an innocent animal. So with that, we've just made it to the halfway mark of this countdown. This video is actually getting super long, so I'm going to end it here and release part 2 next time. So if you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up.